Today, former President Donald Trump is in court for a hearing in his classified documents case. Trump is accused of illegally keeping classified material. He's pleaded not guilty. But it comes as he faces backlash for comments he made over the weekend about the security of NATO. ABC's Perry Russell reports from Washington. President Trump's motorcade arriving at the federal courthouse in South Florida. Just one of his legal cases on the docket today. This one is about the classified documents he's accused of withholding. Trump's stay in court comes after his comments about NATO this weekend. You got to pay. You got to pay your bills. Trump saying he would encourage Russia to attack NATO countries that do not spend enough money on military defense. One of the presidents of a big country stood up and said, well, sir, uh, if we don't pay and we're attacked by Russia, will you protect us? No, I would not protect you. In fact, I would encourage them to do whatever the hell they want. There are no bills to pay in NATO. Each one of the 31 countries shares a goal to spend 2% of GDP on its own military. And as of last year, only 10 countries hit that mark. President Biden calling Trump's statements appalling and dangerous. NATO Secretary General writing, any suggestion that allies will not defend each other undermines all of our security, including that of the U.S. With the South Carolina primary less than two weeks away, Trump rival and former governor of that state, Nikki Haley, jumping on his comments this morning. Russia has never invaded a NATO country. They are scared of the alliance. He just put every military member at risk and every one of our allies at risk just by saying something at a rally like that. Back to the court case in Florida. The judge has ruled some of the information can be made public, even though it is happening behind closed doors. But special counsel Jack Smith is trying to make the judge change her mind. He says it would expose witnesses to harassment. Perry Russell, ABC News, Washington.